the Mercedes-Benz UCI Cross Country World Cup returned to Albstadt in Germany for the first short track race of the season. After snow this morning, conditions cleared up just in time for the riders to prepare for a weekend that could make or break their Olympic ambition. Laura Stieger, Pauline ferrand prevot and Kate Courtney were just a few names in a star-studded lineup. And here we go then, they're off! The best 40 of the UCI ranking. Rebecca McConnell forced her way to the front in the first lap, showing signs of last season's fall, which saw her finish fourth in the final Olympic distance race in Novia Mesto. Still in the lead. The pace remained measured as the field conserved their energy around the opening laps. Then, the unexpected. As the riders made their way into lap three, Linda Indergand attacked. The Swiss moving herself to the front and away from the chasing pack. Looks good for her. It oh really God. does, yeah. The field remained calm, keeping a consistent pace as they grouped together, sharing the work. Although, when Kate Courtney called for help, no one took her up on it. Riders looking to each other, nobody would like to do the work. 27-year-old Indigand continued her dominance, extending her lead to 14 seconds through laps four and five. I just saw that the speed was falling down and I had the opportunity to go to go, go straight to the front and to hit the wall right pretty fast and then I, I realized that I have a small gap and then I just keep going. Here comes the runaway freight train behind her. See how fast they come closer. It wasn't long before the who's who of women's mountain bike racing began to chase her down. Come the final lap, a switch was flipped. Pauline ferrand prevot drove the charge and closed the gap on Indigand. In the midfield, Annie Lass found herself climbing into podium contention. Comes down to a sprint between these two. Here we go then. As the leaders turned into the final straight, it was a sprint for the line between Indigand and ferrand prevot Pauline ferrand prevot winds it up. Indigand looking like she can't respond. And it's going to be Pauline ferrand prevot who takes the winner in the first Short Track World Cup of 2021. Indigand comes across the line in second. Annie last there in third. I didn't really expect to be that good, but uh, you know, I tried to, to just stay on the wheels at the beginning of the race. I didn't want to ride because I knew that I had a headwind uh, in the long uh, and straight uh, road. So I went until the end and uh, yeah, I could finish uh, the walk, so I'm super happy with that win today. It was amazing to be in the front of the race. It's just sad that it didn't work out in the end. And I'm really happy with my performance, even, in the, even with the second place. With eight different nations featuring in the top 10, it's France's Pauline ferrand prevot in the white leader's jersey. 2019's overall World Cup winner, Kate Courtney, starting her season in fourth. And after a quiet 2020, Olympic champion Jenny Risveds rounds out the top 10.